And we do have breaking news from St. Joseph City Council and an update to a story we brought to you earlier. After interviewing six candidates to fill Taylor Krause's vacant seat, the City Council has nominated his replacement. News Press Now's Riley Funk joins us from City Hall with the winner. Riley? That's right. Thank you, Kirsten. And I'm here with the newest member of the City Council for District 2, Jason Esslinger. And, sir, congratulations. Uh, but first and foremost, to the people in your district, what is uh, your message to them as you get ready to go here in the next couple of weeks? Well, thank you. Um, I'm excited. Um, basically, my message is hopefully, you know, we can we can change some things and, um, and you know, and, and do betterment for the uh, south side. And one of the things that you had mentioned, uh, one of your main focuses, uh, making sure the south side is uh, getting cleaned up, making sure that it is getting elevated. Uh, how do you plan to do that in your strategies, and how do you plan to do that with uh, working here with the council in place? Well, hopefully it's a, it's a team effort with the council, and, and you know, not yes, we want to focus on the south side, but I'd like to focus on the city in general. And you're also a uh, business practice uh, here in town. You know you uh, go to court each day. Uh, you know, as a lawyer, what do you think you bring to the table uh, that's different to make this council elevate and, and grow? Well, hopefully I bring, you know, the, the knowledge of the, the south side being that I've lived there for 30-plus years um, and grew up there. But hopefully um, on the council I can help out with, uh, with my legal expertise and, and help around with things like that that we're missing. And uh, for the people that uh, haven't lived in the South Side, how big of an asset is the South Side to the city of St. Joseph? I think it's a huge asset. A lot of businesses down there that um, are pretty big and support the South Side and the city. Well, and my last question for you, now that you're sworn in, how do you uh, plan to celebrate uh, tonight and uh, as you get ready to uh, fill this seat? I haven't really thought about it. Probably doing something with my kids. Well, that sounds great. Well, thank you for uh, talking with me and congratulations. Until then, we're going to have more uh, tonight on News Press Now, but Kirsten, back to you in the studio.